Hello and welcome to Stockwatch, presented by me, Evan Lucas, for Go Market Securities. As always, please have a very good read through of the disclaimer on screen. Everything in this video is general in nature. None of it is relied upon as any form of personal advice. Go Market Securities does not know your personal scenario, nor your personal financial goals, and therefore none of it is relied upon as any form of advice at all. It's just general in nature only. Preview time for CBA. They come out on the 14th of February. It is the second the Wednesday that they always present out their numbers. And we've seen them make a record all-time high leading into these results, which is why I need to really go through them and have a look at whether or not that's justified. Because there is no doubt that at the back half of last calendar year, CBA really started to try and ramp up its loan growth again after actually losing out in that space. Something that it A, didn't like, and B, doesn't happen very often. So let's go through it. First and foremost, the expectation or the consensus number is that for cash earnings to come in at $4.97 billion. It's as high as 5.1 in terms of the range to as low as $5.86 billion on that number. Now, net interest margins are expected to go back up into the 2% level. You've also got a scenario where the non-interest margins are gonna be sitting at about $2.1 billion. And overall, the composition of the results look to be a little bit stronger than the second half of last financial year when they reported them in August. You then need to look at also bad and doubtful debts. We saw personal debts being the ones that grew, only merry marginally, and it's still well below trend at 0.9. Have home loans moved that way? I don't think they have, and that's what I think they're gonna tell you. Dividend is also likely to be pretty reasonable. There's current estimates that's sitting at around about nine, uh, sorry, 297 cents, so $2.97 on that number, which would be up from 287 the year before. Though they're all likely to come true. So again, the question with CBA is this, is it justifying it's well and truly over $100 price tag? Suggestions would be yes. The catch is the growth is now so slow and they're so big and the price is so big that I don't think whatever they deliver for you may be good enough, but that's okay because CBA is still showing that it is the premium and best out there. Watch out for those results. 